Hello, welcome! This is Eversion, a neat little platform game that I played many, many years ago. And it's been on my mind lately for some reason, and I want to play it again. It was a very memorable experience. Cool little game. Uh, let's do it. This will be a quick one. There are eight worlds. And yeah, let's go. Gems, okay, so gems to collect. Can't step on clouds. Those little dudes. Alright, this is... Clear Super Mario Bros. 1-1. Tribute here. Whoa, right, okay. So little spots like this. This is where I can evert. Go to a different world where things are not quite the same. So, let's see. Those bushes are solid in both places, but you notice it's changing a little bit. Things are like made of cardboard here. I think at this layer the clouds are solid, so it would seem. And like if I was here... Yeah, gems up in the clouds I just can't get. So go to this layer for those gems. I don't think there's anything further back here that was of interest. Is that right? Let's check. There was one thing, I found an E. <laughs> Alright. There was a time when I knew this game extremely well. I'm pretty sure I found all the secrets and stuff in it. Uh, there's a bunch. A lot more to it than meets the eye at the start. Uh, so back in Happy Land I fell. Whoopsie. <laughs> uh, okay, still have 18 gems. Good. Was there a checkpoint? No, I'm back at the start. That's fine. I'll stay in Happy Land for now. As with every platformer, controls are a little unique. Kind of used to exactly how they, uh, how things move around. That's all the gems. All right, let's go. Twenty-two out of two hundred and forty. Press the vert button. All right. Happy world here. Twenty-three gems to find. Oops, I got touched. Okay, it looks like I can do a higher jump on one of those if I hold the jump button afterwards. Good to know. Right, cloud's not solid at this point. Need to find an aversion point. Not here. Uh, uh. Okay, you, you're in an awkward spot. I could probably stomp you with some effort. Uh, right, can't get in there right now. I suspect this is where I vert. Yes. Alright, so let's go... Oh, that cloud's in my way. I think I can do a low jump here and be okay. Sure. Alright, so now, cloud's solid. Get those two gems. Let's see, I wonder if I want to do a, uh... Not all gems run first. I know there are multiple endings, and I think whether or not I get all gems may affect it... Yeah, okay, let's do that. Let me intentionally skip a gem in this world here. Alright, how about that one? So that will be the gem that I don't get on this run. Pretty sure I can come back at any time and clean up the ones that I didn't get. So, real easy spot. Uh, I just got myself trapped, didn't I? However, there's an aversion point. Here we go. Can hear a little bit of the, uh, the music of the next zone. Cloud's still solid. Mountains are having a bad time back there. These blocks are not happy either. And I don't want to get all the letters. I got an E in the last... Oh right, can't go any farther back than that. Unless maybe if I'm on the clouds, but I don't think I can be? Can I make it up there? Uh, wait. Did I? My, my jump was weird. Okay, I see what happened. If I... If I'm going upward and holding left, I can sometimes catch on the bottom of a block and it halts my upward movement, even if I'm still holding the button. I think I can maybe make that jump. Alright, 22 out of 23 gems. Okay, there was a checkpoint here. That's what those dudes look like in this zone. That's the easy way to get up. Yeah, there's the V. Okay, I need to start not looking for those. <laughs> if I want to finish the game without all of them. There's also a... 
some sneaky little bug here. Somehow I can... If I hit my head on the side of a block just right... I won't be using it, I just want to show this off if I can get it to happen. Exact conditions for it. Maybe I have to be like under a... Uh... Well, I can't jump at all under there. Jump button doing nothing. There's totally a way to uh, hit the corner of a, a block just right, and then I can just, like, float forever. It's a weird little glitch. Apparently I don't remember how to do it. It's something like this, just hold the jump button, hit the lower corner of a thing, and you can just go forever. I've done it before. Anyway, let's not mess with that. Squish. Alright, so now I could go back to layer 2. I'm in layer 3 right now. Let's exit in layer 3, sure. Alright, missed one gem on purpose, world two. So I'm on layer two, no aversion point here. And I can get all the gems here. Okay, so right, clouds are solid. I need happy land for clouds not to be. Alright. Uh, I can't break that brick. But I need, let's see, somewhere here. This aversion point covers that whole area. Great. Can't break the brick. Uh, there's another point here. Here we go. Layer 3. But I can go back to layer 2 if I want. Oh, hey, um... So here's the only aversion point I can access on this layer. But I see, like, two little circles calling out to me there. Okay, clouds are solid here. Uh, oh, I can just press the button and see the circles. Got it. Okay, so... Great, yeah. So just press when I want to see where I can go. Cool. Back in the happy. That's the circle. Alright. You get the picture. Oh, I know I can, Bob, that. Alright, layer four. Cloud's not solid again. In this layer, those guys hold completely still. Uh, bricks can be broken, apparently. Great. Clouds, right. Clouds not solid here. Uh, there's a gem there. Ah, shoot, I found a second E. Alright. How do I not find the text? <laughs> I remember this too well. <laughs> ah. Alright, I'll stay in this layer and go this way. Uh, those blocks are having an expression on their face. Let's see, I might want to keep... Okay, no aversion points nearby. I don't think I can jump to break these right now. Yeah, no jumping from here. Already found the letter, so I guess I want to just get all the gems. Okay, I can do that. Can I somehow... I think it's going to let me make that jump. Gotta do some trickery. Maybe I can... Uh, hmm. Ride the clouds if I'm in a different layer? But if I'm in a different layer... Well, I broke a... Uh, a brick back here. So let's navigate these. There we go. So this way... This way... This way, this way. Hang on, I want solid clouds, right? Right. Problem is I'm not up there, and the dude who I would need to get me up there is dead right now. So, alright. Maybe I just can't get those gems right now. That's what it's starting to seem like. Alright, so here, here... Here. <laughs> this game has a pretty good soundtrack. So, you would boost me up there, but the clouds are not solid. That's the problem. I just, I can't do a jump there. There's no point when I'm on the ground with, without a, uh, a thing over my head. So, I guess I won't have those this run. Well, that's the problem, isn't it? 
Okay, I can uh, cause you to move so I can get past. Sure. Yeah, I won't be making that. I don't think you're going to walk off of there. Like, I can let you walk for a moment. And then check back in. Like, they, they don't walk off ledges. Alright, well, let's do this. Maybe this will make it possible to get up there. So I'm checkpointed here. Everyone should have respawned. Giving me another chance at... Something, maybe. How will I arrange this? Open that. Don't kill any of those. Go through all the layers to navigate this place. And sure, let's do this in Happy Land. No, 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 I need solid clouds. There are two. So if I'm doing this in layer two, I wonder what that changes. Uh, I refound the third letter. All right. Well, that's fine. All right. Well, I guess I'm going to proceed in this layer for now and just see what happens. Maybe things will be fine. I'm still missing a bunch of gems. Now nah, I think I have a problem here. Oh. Okay. So, suddenly I was kicked into this lair. Uh, I missed one gem there. I'm gonna have to come back for it. Uh, you. Can I get you real quick? Yes, I sacrificed myself for those. Alright, so 38 out of whatever. You're a problem there. I have to get here differently. I can't do it on this run. Okay, so that's two, uh, two spots where I cannot get all the gems that- or... One where I did it on purpose, one where I... Did it by accident. Alright, there we go. Alright, Cloud of Darkness follows after me. Alright, happy place! One block to hit. Nothing suspicious going on here, right? No aversion points. And now we're in layer 5. Where the blocks don't pop out gems anymore. Uh -huh. Ah! Oh, those things. <laughs> They're never not scary. Uh, blobs are moving again. Yeah, so those big nasty hands that come out of the, the place. Ah. <laughs> uh. And the noise they make. Just something about them always gets me. No matter how many times I've seen it. <laughs> Alright, so big nasty hands now. <laughs> uh. yeah, well, I fell. But I have the gems. That's fine. Uh, I should be hitting that button occasionally to look for uh, inversion points. Ah! Right. Okay, so just make the jump as if the hand is always there. Like that. No aversion points here. I don't want to break that brick. Uh, hand? Yeah, I suspected so. Hand? Where do I avert? Nowhere? Ah, shoot. Feels like there might be a letter in between those two platforms right there. No, that's inaccessible. There are too many hands around. Okay, I'm gonna deliberately try not to get the letter here. I want to not get it in one of the stages, at least. Although, let's see. Actually, I think I remember what the letters do, and it should be okay to get them all and still be able to find all the endings, maybe. Alright, clumsiness. These jumps are not actually the easiest thing. Gotta get into a little one-tile gap there. Alright, going across is much easier. No aversion points here. I'm just stuck in layer 5 forever. And I think that's kind of the point of World 4. Oh, 4, 5, I see. It shows me my, my layer in the, uh, in the top right there. So World 4, layer 5. Is there not... Ah, so I can only... 
I can only press the button and see that come out when I've used the, uh... When I've actually averted in the place. Okay. So the hands are not... <sighs> present here. <laughs> Clumsiness still is, though. Okay, so, here. I get to avert. Back to layer 4. World 4-4, there's the exit. All those unhappy blocks I saw all need to be bopped. Okay, so don't... Dude. So like I was saying, all those unhappy blocks need to be bopped. There, I made the jump! <laughs> Finally. Uh, that little eye slime was freaking out in that left, uh, thingy, which is now solid in this layer. Uh... Because he got embedded in it. So apparently they do try to move, or at least turn around. They just have their move speed set to zero. Look at that sun in the back. That's really something. Okay, I didn't smash this brick, therefore... I can continue down this way... I have not found the letter in this uh, stage yet. And I'd like to keep it that way, I just want all the gems. Problem is... Uh, okay, I have them all. That one block back there doesn't have one. Great. Okay, I did not get the R. It might be down there somewhere. It seems like I'd die if I went down there. Hmm. Maybe I have to die for the letter. It also could be, like, just down below me. That's very possible. When I'm looking for it, those are the places I'll check. Okay, are there any more aversion points around here? It doesn't seem like it. Alright, let's exit in layer 5. Sure. Alright. World 5. Okay, this was one way back in the day. I spent some time speedrunning this, and for a time, I believe I did actually have the world record on it, on the, uh, the official leaderboards in the game. That's what I remember. Uh, that was long, long ago, though, and I'm sure this is, that's long since been overtaken. Like I said, I did spend a lot of time playing this game. So there was one aversion point to go up there, but I can also go down here if I want to. Uh, and I have to because there's no way through... No way through these bricks from here in this layer. Yeah, so I know about that thing. So what I have to find is this. Oh, well, there goes my score. Alright, we're in layer 6 now. The clouds are taking on demonic forms, and these bricks, importantly, break. Also, those look awfully thorny! I bet I don't want to touch them. Let's see, is there a way to... Uh, yeah, there is a way to... Uh, but it's a little uncomfortable, and now I've lost access to that. <laughs> and now there's blood when I die, apparently. <laughs> Alright. Alright, there's six. Mountains are growing arms and faces. If I just walk through the bottom here, that kind of works. Alright, you grew some teeth. I'm gonna leave these things alone and look for an aversion point, I think. Oh, I, right, yeah, okay, so don't touch the thorns. <laughs> I know this. Uh, I won't be getting back there. Uh, let's see, I guess, I guess just the only way through is that. Maybe, let's see, there's probably a way to... Well, I messed it up. Yep, messed everything up. Okay, fine, whatever. Yeah, so routing this. Not the most obvious thing, actually. I probably want to leave some bricks around sometimes. Yeah, the thorn's down there. Uh, okay, so... I won't be coming back this way, so I better get these now. Hey, I made that work. There are a lot of gems here. I feel like I'm missing some important stuff. Like, there's gotta be an aversion point somewhere... where from here I can get back to, uh... another lair. Here's one. There's the exit. The flag is just completely still. Oh, it is here too. Alright. So I need to drill down into those bricks from here... Okay, that's gonna be something. 
So make a traversable... Okay, sure. Let's do it this way. I can just hold the jump button and... Ugh! Well, maybe. Those won't give up their secrets in this lair. Alright, so this works. No, it doesn't. I need to go back further. Okay, so I need to keep going back and find another reversion point. The thorns went away. Uh, here we go. I'm not sure I can go back any farther than layer 4 in World 5. Maybe I can? So right, beyond the obvious, you know, <laughs> horror elements and jump scares and things, is a pretty solid little platformer. And that's the part of the game that I'm engaging with right now. Honestly though, the horror and jump scares stuff, also fun in their own ways. There must not be any gems back there because I can't get back there. Problem is, I'm missing a bunch. So there must be. Okay, well, we're doing gem cleanup. And letter cleanup because I didn't find that either. Alright. Missing two letters. Okay, starting at- ah! Okay, now we're in layer 7. The audio's different. Okay, yeah, so, uh, well, hmm. Alright, so if I repress the jump button at any point in the air, I will be jumping when I hit the ground. Got it. Well. Game over. Right. Wait a second. Is that... Does that normally say game over? Didn't it have a different message for me earlier? I mean, that's exactly something this game would do, so probably. Alright, so, second version of the, uh, red hands. It got me. Ooh. Who's that dude way up there? He's a little suspicious. This is an interesting way of doing jump buffering in a game like this. I kind of like it. Ah, right, those are back. See, the ones that fly through the air aren't, aren't anywhere near as scary. They don't come with a big loud sound. Alright. Ah! I can squish you. Makes red circles all over the screen. There, I got that skull. Um, well... I guess I'll move on. Maybe get that skull later. Maybe. I'll get this one now. I got it. I died. That's fine. Starting from here every time. There's a little story that comes with this game. Uh... I've read it briefly. Um, I don't think it's super relevant to what's going on here, but th there is one if you're interested in that. ZT is trying to... that's who I'm playing as. Is trying to rescue the Princess of the Flower Kingdom or something? I think that's how it is. From someone. Hey, I found a checkpoint. That's nice. Alright, yeah, so that jump... I see you! Uh oh! <laughs> yeah, okay. That text is changing. Ready to die. <laughs> ah. Stop. Okay, so I think it's maybe the messages there are Let's go under. Maybe that makes more sense. It does. Ah. It does. But it didn't work. Alright, you go away. You do this. You do this. There we go. I got the skull. Uh, do those break from the top? They do. I don't want to go this way though. Um well mm, don't get much choice. Skull's up top. Alright, so be far ahead. I don't think I can gain all that much distance on the red swarm there, though. Oh, I, I, I broke the stuff, but I got... I got redded. I can make that jump, right? Is it faster? Maybe I can't. Maybe I have to go under. Oh, that was just black. No text at all. <laughs> Alright, you, you're in my way. So I need to just, like, figure out how to squeeze myself into small places here. Ah! And go faster. Yeah, those skulls. Those are not trivial to get. Nope. I have to, I think I have to get there ahead of that hand, maybe. Uh, 
All right, so, okay, so it's at a random uh, vertical position. Wait, can't I just jump over to the right and have a much easier time of this? Because the, uh, the shape of the platform should make that possible, right? Let's uh, check it. I like how sometimes it just gives me a normal ready message, just to throw me off. All right, is the shape such that I can just go, yeah, it totally is. <sighs> Except, like, everything's hard to do. <laughs> just the way the, uh, the way it is. So yeah, it's probably still gonna be better to try to go to the left. And yeah, randomness there can just get in my way, so I might just have to try this as many times as it takes to get up there. Uh, did I do it? No, I didn't. Alright, you're in a good spot. How about the next one? In a good spot. There we go, there we go, there we go. Okay, 32 out of 32. World clear. So starting in 7 7, 187 out of 240, right, yeah, so that's where my gem check is. Uh, something happens if I have all of them. That's what those blocks are like. Hi, hand, you're here. I think I can just take these and it'll be okay. No. Behind me. Alright, so let's not take those from there. Gotta find an aversion point first. Wait, you're a different... Oh, right! I know what those are, right. Those are what the rocks turn into. <laughs> They're little monsters here. I found a diversion point. Before I use it, let's look ahead. Although, well, I kind of want to use it to get the stuff back there, but yeah, let's look ahead first. Uh, you need to get out of here. All right, you're gonna become a rock, but for now you can just boost me up there, which does me no good at all. All right, so thorns there, so I need to go back at least two layers to get that stuff. And yeah, it's impossible to have all the gems when I first arrive at that gem check spot. Uh, no hands in these uh, lava pits, because there are gems in this stage. I have 14 out of 46 question marks. I can squeeze myself in there, sure, okay. So yeah, I am benefiting from being on this layer. I can I can break those. I can break this if I want. That might be handy for later. I'm gonna go all the way back. Uh, yeah, I can get back through there, I think. There's gonna be a hand. There's gonna be a hand. Um, this is, at this point, a pretty long way I'm gonna be going back. Perhaps I should have averted. I chose not to though. Oh, okay. Brick broken state resets on death. That's important to know. So this would get me to the flag. And I'm kind of locked in now, so I guess we're doing it. Okay, flag it is. Total gems, 209 out of 240. Press avert button. All right, everything's happy. I win. <laughs> right? Yeah, of course. <laughs> this isn't interactive, by the way. I can't move around. My character always remains the same as everything changes around him. There's an eye in the background. Game over. And then the game quits. <laughs> All right, next time, gem and letter cleanup, and we'll explore some of the secrets.